To get started with Visi, we're going to make a new patcher. File, new patcher. We're also going to use the file browser to access movie files. File, new file browser. Inside the file browser, on the left hand side there are a bunch of saved searches. Click on the movie files saved search. Okay, now with your mouse in the unlocked patcher window, right click. If you're on Mac, hold down the control key and click. Scroll down to paste from, then down to fizzy clippings, then to fizzy PVR, and let your mouse go when you're over the player. Repeat this again for another module. Right click or control click, paste from, Fizzy Clippings, this time it's Fizzy EFX, and we want the Burkosa module. See how you can move these modules around while your patcher says it's unlocked in the top in the title bar. Now let's lock the patch by clicking on the padlock icon at the bottom left hand edge of the patcher window. This puts our patch into performance mode and lets us operate the modules. Try dragging a video from the file browser into the player module. Hit play and mess around with the controls to manipulate the video. Now let's hook the player up to the Burkosa module. To do this, we need to edit the patch and use patch chords. First, let's unlock the patch for editing by clicking the padlock icon in the bottom left corner of the patcher window. The video ins and outs are labeled with text in Visi. The inputs are on the tops of the modules and the outputs are at the bottom. These circles are for advanced functionality we'll get to in a later video, so you can leave them alone for now. You can connect video modules together by clicking and dragging patch cord lines between the inputs and outputs. Click and drag from the player's video outlet to the Burkosa's video inlet. And you'll see the video playing in the Burkosa's preview window. Click the padlock icon again to lock the patch. Now you can change the brightness, contrast and saturation of the video by adjusting Burkosa's controls. Now I'm going to unlock the patch so we can add some more effects modules. There are lots of other effects modules to play around with. You can find them in the clippings folder called Visi EFX. Just place them in your unlocked patcher window and start patching them together. I'm going to do some patching right now with Pixelator. Video out goes to video in. What if I want to change this patch so that the output of the Burkosa goes to the input of the Pixelator? To do that, I need to edit the patch chord. Patch chords can be selected and deleted in Max patches. Also, you can change the start and end points of a patch chord by dragging on the red or green diamonds at each end of it. Here's a handy module, it's called the Viewer module. Fizzy Clippings, PVR, 
viewer. With this module, you can make the output of your patch expand to full screen on your computer's monitor. Let's hook up the output from Pixelator to the input of the viewer. Now, we can lock the patch, and if we click on the full screen button, then our video will go to full screen on our monitor. Use the escape key on your computer's keyboard to get you back to the patch. A common effect is a video crossfade. I'm going to unlock the patch, and for this effect, I'm going to add EFX X Fader. Okay, I'm going to do some patching here. I'm going to create two video streams and show you how to crossfade between them. I'm going to select that patch cord. Now I have two outputs. Delete that patch cord. Notice how the X fader has two inputs, video 1 and video 2. So the output of the Burkosa module can go to video 1, and the output of the Pixelator module can go to video 2. The X fader module has one output, which can go to our viewer. Now I'm going to lock the patch again. And I can use this fader to control which image is getting sent to the viewer. In addition to effects modules, you'll find other player viewer modules for grabbing webcam video or recording your output. Experiment and see what combinations you can come up with. In the next video, we'll look in more detail at how we can use the other categories of Visi modules to make more complex patches.